Keith, we're sitting in front of your Colchester machine, the Student CNC. You released this last October, didn't you? Yeah, at our open house, yeah. What's so different about this machine compared to the old models? Um, so this is actually built on a, a traditional student centre lathe. Okay. Uh, similar to our Alphas, where all of our machines are tall room grade, very rigid, robust, accurate machines. So what we've done is, is turned it into an entry level CNC machine. Uh, fan at control, it's got manual guide eye on it. All the programming's done through that. So it's, it's a traditional centre lathe with all the, uh, the benefits of that but with a CNC control. How important are these types of machines for the industry? Because there is a big jump, isn't there, from going from manual operating straight through to CNC, and some people can get kind of lost in yeah. the middle. This is ideal, certainly for schools and colleges as well. Uh, education, uh, because everybody knows our, the Colchester student name, the brand, synonymous with you know the quality that we produce, um, it's a natural progression into, uh, into the, an industrial standard CNC control. What's the um, what's the measurement between so, the two centres? This is a, a metre between centres. Okay. Uh, it's a 330 swing over the bed and a 40 mil spindle board. Okay. So yeah, it's a, a good machine for industry as well. We've sold quite a few into um, tool rooms, prototype type shops as well, small batches. Talking about tool rooms, um, this machine is great to be in a tool room. Basically, what I'm thinking is if you've got a component like you have in the chuck but you want to add something like an external groove or a thread. How easy is it and time consuming is it yeah, to here? No, it's very, very simple. The manual guide eye is very easy to use. It's a conversational system. You can do it full ISO if you need to, but with a conversational system, straight in there, put your coordinates in and off you go. So this is the first time that this machine has been at Southern Manufacturing, it's right? The first time we've exhibited at Southern Manufacturing as well. Um, because we've got our showroom up in, in Elland in West Yorkshire, we've got Mac coming up in April. We thought it would be a good idea to, uh, to treat the, uh, the southern area as well. So, and we've already booked for next year. Brilliant. Well, we'll be seeing you next year, Keith. Definitely.